successful work with using some Tomcat stuff. And you know, I like the fact that um, I can, I think, open these up and put more bait in them, which might be a nice thing. I think these open back up again. And I have a bunch of mouses. I have a ginormous problem. So I am going to get rid of my mouses and I didn't realize that this is a whole kit thing and it comes with four of them. So that's gonna be very lovely. And the dog is not allowed to touch them, but I also have stainless uh, steel, the wool, which is going to be nice because this is going into my vent. The things that we have problems with with this neighborhood. And I got some paint cleaning rags, but these rags I'm going to use for other things too. Not just painting. This one's ripped. Nice. That's okay. And then of course I've got my water thing. So this was today's thing, a shopping supply. And I can't remember if I have a 12 inch or a 14 inch saw. So I got both, but guess what? One of those will probably be going back. Was that everything? You know, all this was a hundred bucks. Can you believe it? These are always expensive. These weren't that expensive. This was really expensive. You know, you can get still wool for less expensive in other places weird stuff but anyway um the tomcat things i thought they had i did not realize the dog can't get to this unless he eats the mouse and then he's going to be in trouble but he doesn't usually eat rodents and he doesn't usually play with them i don't think either so we are going to kill the rodent. By leaving a couple of these in a couple different spots. And then the dog can't get in. I think that will be a better idea. Um, most of them are going to be in places that he is not in. So it will be fine. Like the closet. He doesn't ever go in there. But for some weird reason the mice like the closet. There's a bunch of um, dog hair and a bunch of other stuff in there. And then of course underneath the sink, he doesn't go underneath the sink. He never goes underneath the sink. And so I always make sure he can't get in there. And then the garage, he never can get into the garage either. So there's going to be lots of these in the garage. And In my closet, I think I'm going to put some too, just to make sure that they don't eat anything in my closet. But eventually it will have to come out anyway because we will be redoing my closet here. Um, we are basically getting our stuff ready for this year. Um, I might put some of these down in the attic in the crawl space not in the attic the crawl space because i think this might be a good idea and then also maybe in the attic too actually because i have to rewire anyway up there and there was a lot of mouse poop up there so it might be a good idea to stick some of these up there too but then you are not allowed to have this at all okay shobi you can't have this at all it's a law no so this will not go anywhere where he can get to so it will not go outside anywhere where he can get to the only places that it will go is where he will not be around um he doesn't go back behind things um he stays in certain areas where i can see him most of the time so i think we're going to be okay but I want to get rid of the mice because I don't want him to have any issues. 
and then maybe we'll use the other the natural stuff oh my gosh i'm so tired it has been quite the day um i've already cleaned half of some of the house anyway and vacuumed which you have seen that in part of this video and in part of this video, what we are going to do is I am thinking about winterizing all the sprinklers and everything. Um, we'll see if I get to it today. I kind of also need to do stuff for... For... Um, Getting that tree branch off my freaking roof but I am so dang tired because this fall weather has made me so tired I don't know about any of you guys but my fall feels like I am always tired I don't know what it is I think I need to like go back to sleep or something I've been feeling like that for the past couple weeks and then also PTSD issues, which, yeah, no, no. Um, so I have some saw, some blades, which is nice. Um, I can't remember what size it, what size it is. It's either a 12 or a 14. I can't ever, huh, I can't ever remember which one it is. But I'll tell you what, there's not going to be a mouse in here when I am done. One other thing that we need to do is my closet in this room is a mess. I don't know how all the dog hair just goes right underneath the door and just sticks underneath there. I don't know how the heck it does it, but it does it every single time. So that's freaking annoying. Eventually I need to reorganize that closet again get rid of some stuff again um there's so many plans coming up guys um i am because i am haven't been feeling good for the past two weekends that's why videos are not being out as much so i apologize you're going to have to bear with me um it's nice i think it's like 70 something outside right now and I can't get off the couch. Um, it's supposed to be very cold next week. So I kind of want to get this. Um, all the hoses and everything undone. For the winter time. So while I'm doing that. I think I can manage to walk around the house. Figure out what else needs to be done. We can keep this here. This can stay here and we'll get these set. Um, I'm gonna put them all over the place. Nowhere near the crate though, cause he won't like that. I won't like that either. What is this? Oh, the little fuzzy things. Um, we will keep this out in the garage anywhere where the mice have been noticed before. That is where I'm going to put them. And on top of several of my totes too. I don't want them getting into my totes at all that are out in the garage. I've got thick plastic totes for a reason. So we will be working on all of that today. Um, plus, we vacuumed the house. We did dishes today. We started laundry. It's not all the way done yet. Oh, I have laundry that I could be doing for days. I have projects I could be doing for days. But instead, my brain just keeps wanting me to lay on this freaking couch. And I don't want to lay on the freaking couch anymore. I need to get some of this stuff done. Otherwise, I'm going to... <laughs>
Damn it. Just tell the fucking monitoring company to shove it up their ass. Thank you. 
give you what? A fucking chance to play your fucking cartoon and fucking mimic it on the fucking PCH public television cartoon shit that was done in the fucking 80s? Man, you guys are fucking bimbos. All I can say is cartoons are fucking bimbos. I haven't met a damn cartoon that was fucking smart. Monitoring company, blow me.
fucking show for a fucking piece of shit monetary company? What are you fucking dumb or what? God, you fucking retards. Bombing a board cartoon is always fun for real. Can't you just blow up their house and fucking
go bitches. Public television cartoons fucking showing, so stop showing it.